Hello everyone, in today's tutorial I will show you how you can create your first campaign using the WeMail plugin. So uh, this is the backend dashboard of the WeMail plugin. If you want to create your first campaign, you can click on campaigns which is on the left side or you can just click on the add campaign button uh, just right over there. I'll just go for that one. The first step is to create your campaign name. So I've just set my campaign name in this empty box. Then you choose your campaign type. You can go for standard or automatic. The automatic one is a, a little bit more filtered. You can go for subscribers who are subscribed to a list. So if you go for subscribers who are subscribed to a list, then you make sure you choose your subscribers list as you can see over here here's a bunch of subscribers list and all of these created list have subscribers in them then you choose when you want to send your campaign in this case uh, it is immediately but you can choose based on hour days or weeks and if you choose to uh, send your campaign that way then make sure you set the numbers for your hours days or week if you choose to send to subscribers who are subscribed to a particular segment then make sure to choose the segment from the drop-down list as you can see this whole drop-down list contains segments that have already been created previously so when you have chosen a segment, you can choose when you want to send your campaign. As said before, you can send it immediately, you can send it uh, after a few days, hours, and so on. We're going to send a campaign for standard. So when you've set your standard, all you have to do is choose a subscribers list. So these are a bunch of subscribers lists that have already been created. You can add more list of subscribers so we've added three more but we're just going to add one list of subscribers and this has a number of subscribers within this list then when you're done you click on create campaign and you will be taken to the template section where you will be displayed with ready-made templates and there are many many templates for various categories for new years for announcements all of these have been made. You can even make one from scratch if you want to, but choosing a ready-made template really saves a lot of time for your campaign. So we're just going to choose this ready-made template. So this is what your selected ready-made template looks like. You can save this template, especially if you have created one from scratch, and you can click on preview template if you want a preview of your template. You are also free to customize this ready-made template, so you can add text or even change the image of the existing template. This template looks perfect to me, so I'll just click on the next button to move to the final stage. In the last stage, set your email subject and the pre-header, which is a brief summary that can be seen right next to the email subject when you check your inbox. Then set your company's name and your company's email address and be sure to do the same for the reply to section. In other words, uh, set your company's name and your email address. Here you can see the subscribers list that we have added and since we did not choose automatic campaign, the segment section here is empty. For the campaign delivery, you can choose to send instantly or you can schedule the delivery at a particular time or you can also adjust the timing for a different time zone. So when you are done, you just click on start sending and your campaign will be on its way to be sent to your subscribers. And that is how you can set your first email campaign using WeMail plugin. For more tips and tricks on email marketing, be sure to check out getwemail.io or check out wedevs.com for more information.